With howling winds and heavy snow, driving this scenic Oregon byway can instantly become a white-knuckled experience with tires spinning nearly everywhere you look. That's the biggest downfall is the lack of common sense. Michael Wayne has been clearing the snow all morning. He says vehicles keep spinning out and getting in the way of snow plows. And the reason those drivers keep getting into trouble is quite simple. They're trying to make it without chains. Two people just don't read the signs. It could be chains required on seven signs, and people are still putting chains on right underneath the sign saying they didn't know. State transportation officials say dealing with unprepared travelers is always one of their biggest challenges. Still, there's a lot of people that seem to be caught off guard or never just don't think it's going to be as bad as they're saying. However, most folks are prepared for these tough conditions, including truck driver Gary Lowry, who can chain up tires with the best of them. This snowfall is one of the worst I've seen in a long time. And he should know he drives truck from Portland to Bend three times a week. He knew this would be a bad weekend. Thanks to that wonderful knowledgeable man Matt Zafino, you know. He gave us a good heads up. But for those who took heed and were prepared, it was an enjoyable day on the mountain. And what about those who didn't? I've been in here since uh, probably about 5.30 or 6 this morning, and I've probably had at least half a dozen different vehicles that I've had to dig out of a snowbank. Those folks will likely be buying chains, but first, they may have to take care of some towing bills. Well, preparation really is everything. Transportation crews, they urge everyone to do a little practice at home. Go in the garage, try to put on some chains, take them off, get familiar with how it works, because I'll tell you right now, it is a skill you definitely need out here, Abby. Definitely a skill we all need. Wayne, thank you so much.